as you all can see i am pulled over i don't know if it's pulling up here but there's a cop behind me unfortunately i have an issue i am gonna go straight to maverick harley davidson oil's piling up but you see that hose right there that has a leak what's up my man nice meeting you player oh, what's up man your instagram bro they gotta follow your instagram mm -hmm. man calm looks good i ran into some uh some what'd you say some occasions crazy cages man welcome back everyone to 2147 crew i am on my way to sturgis the day finally has arrived and i am super super happy so i'm also happy to bring you all along to the first time that i've ever been to sturgis and also the first time I've ever taken a long road trip like this. So one way, sorry, one way is 1,296 miles from my home to where I'm staying. So that's the longest road trip I've ever taken one way. And obviously I'm gonna take the same back. And with the driving I'm gonna do or riding I'm gonna do out there, it's gonna be, you know, maybe four or 5,000 miles. So I'm also excited to take y'all to Sturgis with me so y'all can see Sturgis through the eyes of a Sturgis virgin this guy right here <laughs> yes sir anyhow I'm also gonna be passing by Dallas there's a fellow youtuber that goes by the name of Kelly B Glyden so go check out his YouTube page he also rides a lot he has a lot of good content on there he's a good dude man so check him out so I'm gonna show up on his YouTube video and he's gonna show up on my YouTube video so go to his channel and subscribe if you haven't already and you guys might be following him already but I mean just super cool dude so I'm excited to meet him and check out his bike uh, he called it his bike is a, is a road glide and he called it Kong and uh, that's the name of, of his road glide and personally I think it's a pretty good looking bike so I'm, I'm I'm excited to check it out. He got a sound system in it or a new head unit and, and some, he also has the Advent Black Attack headlight on there. But anyhow, we're gonna go check it out. So until then, y'all stay tuned because this video, I'm gonna try to uh, condense as much footage as I can to put it all in one video versus breaking it up in several videos. So y'all stay tuned. And again, if you haven't subscribed yet, go ahead and subscribe because this 131 stage four kit is going to Sturgis as a 131, but it is not coming back. I will repeat this. It is not coming back as a 131 stage four kit. It's gonna come back with some serious aftermarket performance upgrades, in my opinion. So y'all stay tuned because I'm sure y'all wanna see that because you know, I might break down the side of the road or I might not. So y'all stay tuned, but again, subscribe if you, and like if you haven't yet. Hello everyone, I am on my way to Dallas. I'm very close by and I stopped by to top off my 2022 Road Glide with the 131 stage 4 kit and it looks awesome. It looks awesome. However, unfortunately, I have an issue. Yes, I have an issue to the point that I am going to go straight to Maverick Harley Davidson so that way they can look at the issue and uh, and uh, get me back on the road it, it's nothing big that i feel it is if you can see here i don't know if you can see let me get out the way but in there you see where that cable like the ground cable right in there man i'll see if i can zoom in but like the starter's right here right and it's right down there oil's piling up all right it's a little bit of oil but you see that hose right there that kind of goes up this way let me see and it goes to the to the to the rear cylinder that has a leak if you can see it has like a little uh, i'm sorry this is not the best footage here but i'm doing the best i can um if you can see it's compiling the oil there so i think it's just a clamp that's loose so i'm not too worried about it nonetheless um i'm gonna have them look at it and see so they can get me back on the road so yeah so i got that little issue there but again i'm not too worried about it, it looks like it's a clamp and i think it's the top clamp back here but there's nothing else that's leaking that I can see on this side here. So everything else is good. No other leaks or anything like that. So I, like I said, I think it's just a clamp that uh, that came loose and uh, oil hose that just needs to get replaced. Stay tuned. Uh, I'm gonna get to Maverick Harley Davidson. I've never been there before, but I'm gonna take advantage of this uh, Harley Davidson uh, network with their dealerships since it's still in the warranty. 
and um, so we'll see what's up. Okay, we are entering Dallas, Texas, aka D Town. Y'all can see the skyline over there of the buildings. So, Maverick Harley Davidson is our next stop. What's up, my man? Nice meeting you, player. Hey, y'all see you, man. Y'all uh, see What's you, up, man? man? You see the shirt, what it say right there? 2147 crew. 2147. I like your shirt too, play. Here she is, man. Here she is, right here. Yeah. You gotta be kidding me. Oh, man. Ain't that something? Yeah. Oh man. Damn, bro. Okay, let me go take care of this right quick, man. We made it, as I said, to Maverick Harley Davidson. They took care of me. I was in and out in maybe an hour and a half to two hours. That's my man Kelly B gliding over there. Look at that road glide. Ooh, it looks good, don't it? So it was the hose. They said that the hose was a little chewed up up on the top and right here. I hope I'm getting it up right there where the clamp is at so they went ahead and replaced that along with the hose and um yeah no issues no leaks or anything they wrote it they drove it and no leaks or anything like that they're just a little residue because they washed it so maverick harley davidson thank you thank you so so much man look at that road glide Whew, hope we're getting all of this in the gopro damn Whew. yes man man it looks nice so yeah and again the uh, harley davidson network i mean it's 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 a thing man it's a thing and uh i'm just a very proud harley davidson owner they took care of me and it's still under warranty i walked in with didn't pay anything and they were just nothing but nice so um so again thank you all so i can't wait to get the email for the review because i'm gonna hook them up as they well deserve and my man kelly b glyne what's up um Follow him on his channel, Kelly B. Glenn. He pro provides a lot of good content. He goes on nice road trips, and I mean, it's just you just you just kill it, man. So, He's good people, man. <laughs> yeah, man. We just we just hit it off, and uh, and unfortunately, when he was on the way here, unfortunately, he had a, a, a flat in the back, something on the road, and uh, and Maverick Harley Davidson had us in and out in what an hour and a half, if that. Yeah. So, so a big shout out to them, man. But, um, but yeah, I've been watching your bike, man, on your videos, dude, and I'm happy I see it in person, man. Definitely, man. So, this is a 2018, y'all. Okay. I, you know, I got it with like 2,300 miles on it, man. I think I got it right at 13,000. Okay, 13. Man. I did a quite a few modifications to the bike, but I hadn't did no motor work. But like I say, I'm loving it, man. I'm loving the what I'm doing with the bike. Hey, I can't complain, man. Like I say, I don't have a 131, but I'm working toward it. I'm working toward it. I'm working toward it. But man, I, Empire Collection, a lot of mm -hmm. this stuff was on it. The Screaming Eagle intake, the Vans Hind pipes, all that was on there when I got the bike. So, you know, the chopper bars, I did the installment on that. You can go check my videos out. Uh, the heated grips, mm -hmm. I get all that. I'm trying to do stuff that CVO guys took, but save a little money. Mm -hmm. uh, the one finger levers here. They, How you like those? I love them, man. Yeah. Man, one finger. Dude. Oof. And they're adjustable also. Mm -hmm. So I love those. Man. What brand is that? Uh, that's the one finger. The one finger. That's the brand. Okay, okay. Yeah, man. And, and a bunch of custom dynamic lights on here, man. Mm-hmm. Everywhere. Yeah, as you can see, he guys, he's also rolling the Advent Black, man. It looks dope. Yeah. I was gonna go with custom dynamics, but this bike is named Cone. Right. Needed with the real big eyes looking too, but so I went with this, man. So mm -hmm. I'm happy with it, man. Custom dynamic forks, lights. I'm changing these real soon, but I'm really waiting for the motor work. That's my main thing right now. Mm -hmm. a little bit more power a little bit more torque you know, it sounds mean though it sounds mean i was telling i was telling i was telling him that it sounds like an old school muscle car uh camaro just turning on man yeah. hey. i know my bike from anybody when i crank it up man. Mm -hmm. I, know, I know it's yeah you know, he does a lot of stuff i'm i'm happy with it man i started to trade it in but 
Mm -hmm. Yeah, it, it's it's it's. I, I heard it looks great, man, and and it's reliable. I see you hitting the road. No issues at all. Memphis trip down and back safe. Mm -hmm. Arkansas, Tulsa. Got some more trips coming up. Looking forward to it. And looking forward to rolling with my man in 2147. Yes, sir. Man, so mm -hmm. Down there at the Lone Star Rally. So I'm looking forward to that, man. But it's man, a good time. Like you see, man, everything puts some dynamic out with the ad band. Got the sound stream radio. Oh, that's right. Let me get over here. Yeah, kind of upgraded that. Yeah, if y'all looking for a good radio and y'all have the boom box on y'all, they do got the heated grips on. Right? Mm -hmm. uh, the boom box, man, go with the sound stream. You got the car, Apple Play, everything on that, baby. Yeah, the, he made a video on that as well, so check it out. Yeah, and also, video. your Instagram, bro. They got to follow your Instagram. Oh, yeah. Follow me on Instagram at mm -hmm. Killer mm -hmm. so You can just check that out, too. Right. Follow me on both of them, man. Nice, man. Well, I can tell you, man, it's a beautiful bike, man. Um, how do you like your uh, um, the uh, Empire Collection, man? I love the Empire Collection. Yeah. It just, it just flows with the bike, man. Agreed. It flows with the bike, man. I, I can't complain. Dude. I agree. Yeah, because I got the same setup and uh, I like it. Except mine are black. I love it. Black. Yeah. Man. Oh, when you get that change right there, oh, that's going to be hot. <laughs> <laughs> so 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 my man knows knows uh knows what's gonna happen on sturgis because i told him that i'm riding it over there like that but it's coming back totally different. right right so my man knows knows the insight what's going on so uh so yeah but again y'all go to his channel man he made just super cool dude you know we met for the first time but we just hit it off man you would have yeah. think you would have thought we, we were buddies forever man yeah, exactly. so hey, that's, 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 that motorcycle community, man. that's right that's right yes sir and um again you know thank you again man and i know this is d town's your is your hood man and uh, thank you for meeting me out here unfortunately you got the tire situation but uh but you got a new tire and we're safe yeah oh that's <laughs> that is absolutely true 100 percent. but hey my man again thank you very much for having me over man yes, nothing but love and respect man go check out his youtube channel and also follow my man on instagram kelly b gliding I'm calm. This sounds mean. I can hear from here. Get it, Hayabusa. Man, calm looks good. We are entering Oklahoma, everybody. We are leaving Texas and we're entering Oklahoma. Goodbye, Texas. Hello, Oklahoma. Onward. We just crossed into Kansas. Goodbye Oklahoma and hello Kansas. As you all can see, I am pulled over. I don't know if it's pulling up here, but there's a cop behind me, a state trooper. So, um, yeah. I need to Sturgis. As you all can see, I got some bugs uh, on my primary cover. Not sure how that happened. Um, so it definitely uh, is being put through its paces so it'll get washed uh, by some uh, very nice um, uh, people over at Sturgis once I arrived uh, once I arrived there but yeah carbon fiber wheels I was very curious how they were going to perform in a long road trip and I've hit some um, serious bumps along the road but uh, they've proven to just st stay intact man no problem uh, but yeah I'm gonna have some serious uh, <laughs> cleaning to do here and in terms of the leak that I had there as y'all can see, if y'all can kind of see in there, it is dry. I just got to put some degreaser or something, but yeah, no issues there. Other than that, the bike is running flawless. I just topped off with gas, and here we go um, on our journey, right? Hello, Nebraska! And goodbye, Kansas. So onward, we continue to Sturgis. We're back here, 2147 crew. I ran into some, uh, some, what'd you say, some Cajuns? Some crazy Cajuns. Crazy Cajuns, man. So uh, this is what they're riding up here. Yeah, dude. So how's your trip? Great so far. Yeah. Smooth roads, good weather, and clean bathroom. <laughs> awesome, awesome, man. That's good. So what are you guys riding, man? That's a 2011 Street Glide. Okay. 
Man, they look good. They look good. So this is also evidence that the wifeys know we're on the road. <laughs> oh, that's cool. You subscribe to the channel, so big shout out. Thank you, man. Um, and uh, like I said, I'll be at Rapids on the fifth. So. Hope I see you there, buddy. No. All right, brother. All right, right on. have made it to our final destination for this evening tomorrow rest assured we will be in Sturgis this is what the 131 stage 4 kit looks like on the bike after over uh, probably a thousand miles on it from Houston Texas we're about three hours away from Sturgis but I gotta stop here stretch my legs get some rest and edit this video for you all but y'all stay tuned and thank you all for watching because tomorrow <laughs> we are arriving at Sturgis look at all this stuff man anyways y'all stay tuned and thanks for watching